We've gone all the way around again to my turn. Um, since last we spoke, everyone has an elder. Some people have actually gotten two, and um, things have been looking better for USR local. Uh, the the two uh, Wolf Corbett and um, Jonathan, the other two people who had who were in the Copper Age, as you might recall from last video, did not did not follow up their attack. They did not put them into slavery. I kind of thought they might enslave them, but I thought they might just leave them alone too. Um, I think they were just trying to get cubes on the the map so that they could um, fix their demography. Demography wise, Jonathan's looking definitely the best. Um, he's got a fairly fairly clear thing. He went into era two. Bit early, he doesn't have the energy advance yet. However, Wolf Corbett did get the energy advance and he's kind of dominated his neighborship. Um, kind of risky for Jonathan to do that because Wolf hadn't yet, or uh, USR local, sorry. Um, yeah, my name's all crossed, crossed up in the summer heat. Um, so anyway, USR local hadn't yet done that move, so. I don't, I don't know that he could have guessed that he would have been able to domesticate the Asian elephant, which is also more difficult than some other animals. But it worked out for him, so he should be able to get into the Golden Age, and then it, into Era 3 pretty quick, if he if that's what he aims for, um, because he's dominating the neighborship. The Hobbit actually, um, if John can get into Era, Era 2, he's also in a good position to steal livestock and, and move up. Um, but right now, you know that a lot of people are a lot of people are in good positions in a lot of different ways. Um, you know, definitely the best demography is right there. Um, what does this all mean to us? Well, one, we're gonna have a hard time um, stealing livestock because we would have to get through John here, right? So that means we're probably gonna need to um, do it the hard way, which is through naturalization, which is probably all right because we're still a ways away from era two. We we need to make two um, two language and cephalizations before we can get to era two. Um, so we're going to need to be doing some domesticating. We still want to get our demography in check. We want to get rid of this um, this chaos here, and we could do some movements to get us some more space to um, just kind of fill up Africa if we want to. Um, trying to see what else. Yeah, everyone's looking good. Things are looking nice for everyone. Alright, as such, there's actually not a lot of choice for us to make um, th in, in terms of our innovation actions. We're, we're not going to be able to do any domestication yet. Um, if we look at the cards that are available, all the, we, there are two cards that are, they're just very readily available here. The clay and cane baskets and the bark cloth beaters that do everything that we want to do right now, which is fecundity decrease and leg wind encephalization. So there really doesn't need to be a debate uh, with our people here as to what to do because they've kind of, it just seems like the obvious move. So I, but there is a, there is actually a decision to be made through card play and it's made mainly for flavor. Um, and that's which, well, and also which, what order to do the cards. Um, and I guess the the likely order would be to do this one first. So do we want to play this for the left or the right hand side? And I'm gonna say, you know, we've already played, we've already had courtship, um, but I still think that this group would prefer um, courtship to harems uh, in terms of which fecundity decrease to do. Um, I think Little Red might like harems, but he's with a bunch of women who um, are maybe, have maybe not so into that, so he's going to play along and maybe not let that be known. In fact, not maybe, he is going to play along and not let that be known. So so we're going to play this one first for the language and cephalization. We'll do Broca's area, and then followed by good old courtship once again for the fecundity decrease. 